Hi and welcome to my YouTube channel. Thanks for viewing today. Today we're going to be making a lamb biryani. Very, very popular. Um, it stems kind of, all biryani stems from the Middle East. So it's been kind of, you know, it's a very big Middle Eastern dish. Um, so yeah, today we're going to be making lamb biryani. What you're going to need is two tablespoons of oil, biryani onions, five to six pieces of lamb, pinch of salt, a portion of pilau rice, as you can put boiled rice, but pilau rice tastes a lot better. I know for dietary requirements, I've got a lot of customers saying they can't have pilau rice. The boiled rice is fine, but I think it tastes a lot better with pilau rice. One teaspoon of tomato puree, two teaspoons of our desi star mix powder, which is just mixed powder, a teaspoon of bean biryani, which is uh, our biryani spice, a teaspoon of coriander, one slice of tomato, one slice of cucumber for decoration. Yeah, so we're going to get started. First, we are going to put our oil in. So I put one tablespoon there, which is about two teaspoons. So we're just going to let that heat up slightly. So we've got our biryani onions here. Um, I will show you how to cut these. Um, it will, it's all in the description, so there'll be a link below telling you how to cut these. Um, it's just basically onions and peppers, and then we're going to put that in. Then straight away, so straight after the oil that goes in. And then you can put your pinch of salt straight in. That will help caramelise the onions a little bit quicker. Um, so you just let that for a few minutes just cook in. And once it's caramelised slightly, you've got your teaspoon of um, tomato puree. Tomato puree just gives it a very nice colour. The colour just is uh, a lot more looks a bit darker and looks a bit nice. Okay, so you've got your tomato puree in there. Now you can put your pre-cooked lamb. Look, my lamb is still in a sauce, very thin sauce, to keep the lamb moist. So, um, I'm just going to put a few bits of lamb in there. You don't put any of the sauce, just you need the, um, just the lamb, that's it. So let that cook now. It's going to take time for the lamb to get a little bit soft. You know, it's still quite rock hard, the lamb. Unless you've obviously, if you've just cooked the pre-cooked lamb, it's gone and it's already cooked, you can go on to the next step quicker. But my lamb's been in the fridge, so it's still quite hard. So we'll leave that for a little bit, let it cook, stir it always throughout. Keep mixing it. The main way to mix it is, you just move this up and down. The spoon doesn't actually move. So you see my right hand is not moving, just the left hand is going just forward and backwards, forward and backwards. Okay guys, so yeah the lamb's gone soft, um, you can just stab the lamb, just check it soft, that's pretty much soft. Very important now, you put the gas low, very low, put the gas right down, um, then you've got your spices, so we've got our desi style mixed powder, a couple of teaspoons of that, um, and then you've got our boom biryani, just one teaspoon of that. You then get a bit of coriander, a pinch of coriander, and then you just mix it. Let the spice infuse into the lamb. So when you bite into the lamb, you'll find, you'll taste a very nice flavor. So I'll put on low gas. I'm gonna stir it throughout. And then I'm just gonna, you know, make sure it infuses properly. After a couple of minutes, the lamb and the spice are mixed, marinated very well together. So we've got our pilau rice, a portion of pilau rice. Still on low gas. Um, you don't want to put the gas up too high because the spice will burn and the rice will get stuck to the bottom. So that's in now. And then what you want to do is mix the rice in. Just keep mixing it. Any lumpy bits you want to break up. Then you, it's ready to serve out. So 
So you've got the lamb biryani there, um, and it looks a little bit plain. It's just rice with the lamb. So, you know, it's going to taste very good, but you want a little bit of decor. As I've said uh, plenty of times, you taste with your eyes first. So you want to make sure it looks good. So when, you know, you serve out to people, they look at that and they think, wow, that's nice. And already it'll look good. So I just sliced the tomato there and then just kept it whole. I sliced one piece there, a little bit of tomato. And then just sliced a bit of the cucumber and then a little bit of coriander on top. So can you see, you've got a lot of colors going on there. The vibrant colors really, really make the dish just look a lot more attractive. So do you see from there, just by adding one cucumber, one tomato and a sprinkle, how much better does that biryani look? So there you have it guys. We have a lamb biryani.